Last of Us Part 2 is on everybody's mind right now, and the biggest question everybody is asking is when is it going to be released? In this video, I'm going to be giving you all the evidence I managed to find out to the point of 2019's release date. I'm covering Last of Us news, making theories, and analyzing the story, so shoot that subscribe button to be updated with future Last of Us content. Let's get right into it. First, Sony themselves. Sony themselves put out some music to The Last of Us Part 2, which was a great song. However, they listed Last of Us Part 2 to be in 2019. Fans quickly took notice of this and Sony removed it. However, not fast enough. Because gaming websites started talking about this and the information became widespread. Number 2. A developer hyped up the game. Not too long ago, a developer working on the game shared his excitement for the game over on Twitter. This shows that the game is already in a playable state, coming very far along in development, perhaps it's going through bug tests in a beta stage. All that matters is that the game is so far along in development that it is actually in a playable state. Number 3. The PS5 will be releasing soon. The PS5 will be releasing sometime between 2019 and 2020, according to the timetable Sony usually releases its consoles. Since Last of Us Part 2 was scheduled to release on the PS4, it's being speculated it may be like the PS3 version of The Last of Us. The PS3 version of The Last of Us was released on June 2013 on Father's Day and the PS4 being released November 2013, only 5 months later, which gives the team time to make The Last of Us Remastered on the PS4, which is obviously the better version of the game. Part 2 could be released in 2019, so the PS5 should be released the same year or early 2020, giving the team time to make a remastered version on the PS5 using its technology to make the game better overall. Number 4, Mother's Day. The Last of Us 1 was released on Father's Day 2013, which makes sense since we are playing as Joel, a character who lost his daughter and found another in Ellie. Left Behind Last of Us' DLC was released on Valentine's Day. Makes sense because we the player saw Ellie's love for Riley, seeing how they bonded and shared a kiss with one another. So Last of Us Part 2 focusing on Ellie as the main character and seeing a woman who people believe to be Ellie's mother, it makes sense for The Last of Us Part 2 to be released on Mother's Day 2019. This furthers the point when Neil Druckmann himself said during a panel, we may have got someone pregnant, meaning someone is now becoming a mother. Number 5, The Game Awards. The Game Awards was very, very good this year. It's always amazing to see a room full of people with love for gaming gathered in a single room. However, when a joke was told while the Stanley Parable was on screen, and the joke was, what do you mean The Last of Us is releasing in 2019? Saying, within the context of the joke, Last of Us Part 2 is once again gonna win every single award next year as they won a ton of awards for the very first game. So I really enjoyed making this video, going to all the details of 2018, all the information, pretty fun. If I missed anything, let me know in the comment section down below. If you want, I don't get it anymore. I put out new content and everybody rejects and unsubscribe. I put out God of War content and nobody watches. You're all supposed to be my family.